So I would like to tell you a little bit of this year's masterclass because it was special in some ways and uh, I'd like to share some insights that I got. So first of all to say that term difficult but possible used to refer to one of my songs but now it refers more to organize an international event uh, during COVID and it's way less pleasurable than playing difficult but possible. So we had date in June for Masterclass 2021 but then it was postponed to August because um, nobody knew if it would be possible in June. Now I see that actually June is not such a bad date. It seems that the numbers are relatively low and it's quite stressful. I know both for people who are coming and for organizers. This year unfortunately we uh, lost some comrades along the way. Some people didn't show up and it was like last moment cancellation. Which kind of sucks, but I hope we can do it better next year. In these times I feel we need to bring courage to our intentions and actions, otherwise we might get stranded in isolation for indefinite amount of time. Anyway, those were some, let's say, bad surprises, but I had some really nice surprises about this year again. And I would say the most important, the biggest thing for me is to see how well people, uh, the participants, click with each other and how much there is a sense of community and how important that is both for just feeling good to be alive on Earth um, but also as a support for playing which, as you might know, goes on uh, on a whatsapp group or I don't know now they have a different group and like throughout the year the group is connected and they share recordings and new exercises and I really feel immense result of that I mean it's combined with a masterclass which is a kind of intense experience and then um, it just keeps unfolding for the rest of the year this year again we were in uh, our familiar environment at the Kezela farm and it's very nice to be there. And this sense of being together also when it's not the actual teaching is a very very comfortable and beautiful feeling for everyone. And this year for example uh, I remember one night when Tuco was telling a story from the life of Tuco, a true story from life of Tuco and I just don't remember laughing like that uh, for years, you know. This is not what I plan uh, when I'm planning a masterclass, but this is what happens as an incredible side effect of masterclass. Of course, you have to be lucky to get people to come, but then when they are there, the magic happens. One more thing which really inspires me and surprises me every year and this year in particular is how great everybody played at the concert like a concert is a thing that uh, freaks out some people of course there are professional players there as well so they are quite happy to play but some people are not and they are quite inexperienced and they learn for a few days very intensely and then ha they have to play something they are, they are influenced a lot by the teachings but it's hard to put it in, into practice and if you just come and listen to them play while we are practicing you, you could think that the concert will be a total fiasco but you know it, it is not it's like magic how how great everyone is at the concert they, they play so well and the crowd is very supportive. This year the crowd went absolutely bananas. I mean, VIP people were rolling on the floor in front of stage and, you know, it was all set on fire. So the atmosphere is complete. But the point is that really this concert somehow manages to um, bring the best in participants, which is uh, what it is for and it gives further uh, inspiration. and. 
last thing I was like really inspired this year is also how inspired by teaching I was and after many 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 years of teaching many 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 people on a very high level and medium level and even some beginner level I uh, got some really nice beautiful actually amazing uh, exercises this year uh, through inspiration of you know um, being in the room with these people and just thinking like what would be the right exercise the best exercise for these people and then I noticed like there is a search in the library which my inner library which brings out some exercise but then through what is in the air it just gets transformed into something new and this year I was really surprised what came out and uh, um, I see that it's um, this great environment great! which is a growing environment and also for me and it um, gets the best of us out of us and both in playing and in, in teaching and I feel it's a kind of symbiosis that is way beyond what I imagined and what I have experienced in uh, other workshops people just bring incredible amount of incredible energy at masterclass and it just combusts into this super strong didgeridoo experience you really have to be there to understand it how powerful that is and i'm really blessed that these people keep coming despite all you know dragons in the sky uh hunting for airplanes and somebody still uh, arrives at masterclass this is how determine some of the people are. I really hope uh, for next year that more people will come because it, it makes even stronger energy of the group and more is possible. We know he can communicate with whales and do Tai Chi with uh, little asteroids when he jumps out of orbit.